Hi there, welcome back to EU4, I'm Paradox Gamer. Let's get started here. Um, I have been thinking a little bit, let me just put it, put it out to you here. Um, actually, colonial nations, they do provide 50% of their trade power to their overlord. So spamming a lot of uh, colonies in South America and the Caribbean is actually not a bad idea. You can actually see it from here if you if you open up the trade node in the Caribbean and you hover on Portugal. You can see at the bottom here it says receives trade power from Caribus plus 19.1. So that's added on top. I mean after all modifiers 19.1 gets added on top. And they have like uh, 18 points more than power, power points more than me. So you can see the difference. That is the difference solely made by the colonial company. Uh, colonial, colonial nation, that's how it is. <laughs> Trade company, colonial nation. You gotta distinguish these two. Um, yeah, you know, so Great Britain and Portugal are taking a lot in the Caribbean. Um, I think I'm gonna go send someone up there just to uh, to be present in that location. Uh, but currently we have uh, one colon colonist on the way to uh, to Boni here, and I think I'm doing a pretty good job of keeping other Western powers out of the Cape. Um, let's see. Army, army wise, I have two armies down here. I have one over here. And where's the last one? That's down here. So, does the one still have unrest? Yeah, it still has a lot of unrest here. And if, if, you, uh, if you put the local autonomy on top of this, uh, there's a lot of uh, trade power gone to waste there because of the local autonomy. The colonial nations don't have that. I'm pretty sure. You can see here. This is Caribas. Local autonomy 0%. So that's actually a pretty good idea to get that colonial nation up and running. All right, so let's go. Let's let's do that. So uh, we will continue on expanding in Africa as well. We do now have four colonies, uh, co uh, colonists. So um, we can continue with two in Africa and two in South America. And when we can get the policy, let me see. That's the um, as far as I remember. It's the expansion and quality, or is it ex expansion and quantity? I'm not sure. I think we can see that by hovering here, don't we? Can we? Quantity? Oh, they have deleted that. I oh, can see it here. Quantity? Let me just see a one colonist, yeah, with expansion. So that is quantity. I should go for quantity for the next one. That will give me another colonist. And when can we do that? level 14 we are now in at level 10 so that's a uh, quite a while until we can do that All right, let's unpause here and get going how many ships can I build by the way we can build a lot I think I should start on building some more light ships I just don't have that much money Okay, let's see when the colonist arrives in about a month. And there'll still be three more provinces on this stretch here. And as, as soon as I can spare some troops, there we go. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, protectorate Congo. I 
Right, so... Missions. That's establish a colony in the Caribbean. That is actually not a bad one. <clears throat> let's click, let's take that. The next colony to finish is probably Illyrius over here. Yeah, we got the native risings, poor vintage. This one here. It's gonna be the next one. And then I'm gonna send one uh, up north this time. Go ahead and check that out here. How far north can we go? We can go pretty far. I'm gonna go for the mainland, uh, the Spanish main over here. One of these. Probably this one. Uh, if uh, nobody else takes it before me. It's tropical though. Maybe this island here. Hmm. Yep, so um, also the cape will be done uh, pretty soon. And uh, ivory in Witta, nice. And so I'm not sure with that. Um, of course that will open up the eastern coast here, but um, I'm a bit keen on closing off this area, to be honest. So the Cape guy will probably go to Cameroon or Calabar here. Hmm, I don't know. It's always decisions, right? Uh, colonial range, uh, level 17. No, level 9. I'll be the next one. Yeah, I think Portugal has a pretty long range at this point because they can they can uh, take range from here. I'm pretty sure if they want to put a colony in Africa, they can do it. Apparently, they don't want to. I can get a couple more troops. Let's put them back in Spain. Here we go. Franz, you beast. What are we going to do with you? <clears throat> right, so I'm also gonna form a uh, trade. Uh, oops, oh, that's not me. Um, what's it called? A trade company? Yeah. So to watch out for is the trade company region. Starts all the way up here, and then it ends here. So, how many colonies left for that? Uh, there'll be two down here and three up here so five left in that trade company area oh the cape is actually going to be the first one finishing yeah they do finish pretty fast when it's not tropical so is this tropical here? It's arid. This one's also arid. Uh, what's this? Local nobles' power grows. Gain prestige, 20 noble regiments in Asturias. Uh, 
Let's take the 20 rebels. How many troops do I have here? Just 19. Do I have a uh, general? Yeah, I do. Where is this guy? He is here, okay. Now let's put him on the troops here. And then go to Asturias. Where is that? It's up there. And let's pick this one. Native assimilation in Wither. Gain 100. Nice. Gotta love that. Let's fight these rebels. It's a tough fight, but we got the cannons. It should make the difference. No. Let's get out of there. Oh, we just left the Navarans there. Sorry, guys. Didn't realize that. Okay, we're just going to refit that. Uh, yeah, so Wither is on 578. Hmm. Let's go back to Lyon here. Cooperation with the merchant class. Nice. All right. Just got to refit a little bit more here. Give it another month. And then we can go in. Colony is self sustaining. Excellent. That's really, really good. Yeah, that's pretty fast. Uh, let's see. Where's the fleet? Should be here. Let's get them down there. But the question is should we take some of the fast ones here? All of these? are pretty fast to colonize uh, or should we try to close it up here they do have Portuguese ships all over the place here it doesn't look like they have colonies anywhere Alright, let's go here and let's send the colonists there. Calabar. And let's go back to Spain and see how that battle turns out. <clears throat> Hello there. This time, we'll get him. Okay, dokie. A lot of Portuguese activity around here. I ain't like it. it. Oh, native assimilation in Ilius. That should finish that. No, not yet. Almost. So let's get these guys on the boats here and sail them back. See when will they arrive? Still 86 days to go. Where's the ship? It's very slow. Okay, we're gonna march in then and then just sail in there there we go so that was that um, yeah Illyrius is 868 so that will be done pretty soon Portugal is back to three colonies here we lost the claim on Alicante really 
Mm, let's reclaim it then. I don't like these guys anymore. Gain 100 in Illyrius. That should almost seal it. That should seal it. Yeah. So that is done. Let's get the boats there. And then we can send our guy up here to this place. Nice. Welcome to the Caribbean. Let's just see what I can uh, upgrade here. Ooh, Spanish Square. I am ahead of time by six years. Uh, but I'm completely capped here, so... Hmm, yeah, why not? Tasio and Free Shooter Infantry. Also, we got the Diplo. Dry Dock, Trade Depot. Let's build some of those. As soon as we get some more money. Okay, let's follow this ship here. Put these guys on there. Well, let's get them over here. Da 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 da. Curacao. See, the problem here is, oh, they can just dock then. That's fine. So, settler chance and global settler increase. That's very, 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 very nice. Can we get another one of those, please? Uh, not immediately, no. Okay, let the ships uh, repair there, and let's wait until the end of the month before we uh, do that. Alright, so we can get another merchant as well, let's go ahead and do that. Plus yearly paper influence, plus two. Now where should we put the extra merchant? Let's go to the trade map mode. So we now have the access to the Cape, but there's not really much trade going on down here yet, so... Um, we got this one. It's already worth more than this one over here. There's also the Caribbean. But that's also not worth much yet. I think I'm gonna put him in here. And transfer trade here. The merchants. Hello. All right, end of the month. Something like that. Let's go to what? Tertio. Tertio Infantry. They'll get uh, some morale back already there. Nice. Oh, Native Rising in Curacao. Okay, we got them. Even with less morale. Still okay. Particularists. No, heretics. And so the next is Wither. Next colony done will be Wither. Large revolt, blah blah blah. I love when they come a lot of there. Native exploitation. So this one is settler chance, lose 40 ducats. Uh, definitely. No question about that. Tiger practice, 9 peasants in Burgos. 
All right, let's go back here. Burgas is here. Let's just get the troops up there. Peasants should be no problem. Hello. Yeah. That was really no problem. Okay, I'm gonna put a break in here, folks. We'll continue in the next episode. Hope to see you there, okay? Bye-bye.